Ja? Herein! Oh, sorry, I didn't know you were busy. <laughs> Mach nicht, I'm always up for company. Okay. So, amuse me, Herr Knight. Tell me about the club. From what I hear, you've already grilled the others about it. Really, it's so tedious. All right, uh, we can talk about something else. Can I assume you're a fan of the club philosophy? Well, look at me. I love to eat and I love to drink. I own a butchery and a brewery, which means I love people who love to eat and drink. <laughs> if I could make it a national religion, I would. <laughs> Point taken. Do you know what type of animal we'll be hunting tomorrow? Deer, I suppose. Oh, that's too bad. I mean, it's too bad we don't have something more interesting to hunt. What do you mean? Well, Grossberg's death's gonna make it difficult to get anything really challenging. Leopards, lions, things like that. You enjoy sticking your neck out, don't you? Do I? If it were me, I wouldn't want to get on the wrong side of someone like Von Zell. Were you the club's main contact with Grossberg? Yeah. Buying and selling exotic animals isn't exactly legal in Germany. The others didn't want to know. What does Baron Von Zell have to do with Grossberg? Nothing. But he knew Grossberg. You asked him about Grossberg the other night at the club. My, what big ears you have. You gave Von Zell Grossberg's name, why? Because he asked me for it. Do you know why Von Zell wanted Grossberg's name? He did not share his reasons with me. Well, you must have thought something. I assumed that since Von Zell was getting too big for his britches, and since he was no longer Von Glauer's pet, that he had intentions of leaving and starting his own club. And you didn't have a problem helping him go independent? I would love to see him leave. And I'm not the only one. Would your cooperation in giving out Grossberg's name have anything to do with the money you owe Von Zell? How do you know about the money? You only been with the club a few days. Did the Baron say something? What's a big secret? Von Zell is a banker, isn't he? That's right, he is a banker, and I am a successful businessman. There you go. And he offered to cut your debt in half for a small favor, I understand. It's not your fault Grossberg's dead. Have you heard of the Black Wolf? Nein, I don't know this. Are you sure? Maybe there are Black Wolves here, maybe not. I have never seen them, I have only heard them. What do you mean you heard them? These wolves in the woods. I'm glad I never saw them. They make such sounds. It makes your hair stand on end. Are you telling me you've heard wolves around here? Yeah, of course. You should be sure you don't go out in the dark at night. These wolves, sometimes they sound very close by. But Klingman told me wolves are extinct in Germany, ex except for maybe a few in the Alps. We're not close to the Alps, are we? Yeah, the air doctor is obviously mistaken. There are wolves in the woods. I've heard them myself many times. I think you should excuse yourself now, Herr Knight. It's getting cold. Oh, sure. No problem. Close the door on the way out, please.
I hate it when I come up with ideas like this. If I'm not mistaken, Grossberg was trying to cash in on all the excitement around the missing zoo wolves. Von Zell must have been the new business partner Grossberg told Dorn about. Guess Von Zell didn't care much for the idea. <laughs> 